<laughs> so this is such a vivid production, including some incredible looking costumes. Can you tell us a little bit about the theatrical approach? Uh, well, the costumes are gorgeous. <laughs> yeah. And I have an incredible <laughs> wig, all full of golden studs. I mean, really, I don't remember last time when it was so colorful and really mm. generally so, so beautiful. I love the sets. It's a little bit um, Star Wars sometimes, but I just like <laughs> that you can translate actually the mm -hmm. traditional into modern, and yet it doesn't look completely crazy. I love mm -hmm. it. Yes, it's true. <laughs> uh, for me, the, the, I have a moment very, very, very strange because when I am blind, uh -huh. I'm really blind. <laughs> yeah, because this makeup make me blind. And yesterday it was funny because the, the prompter was uh, without light. And when I have to stop, you know, the meal, I was, I was uh, lost. Where oh I have to gosh. stop because I saw nothing. But, you could have uh, been anywhere yeah, on the yeah, stage. Yeah. But it was nice for the character because uh, <laughs> it's, re it's really in that moment. Uh, well, good. Method acting. Yeah. Oh, that's fine. <laughs> good. So Elena Dalila marks a turn into heavier, more dramatic repertoire mm. for you here at the Met. Um, so what attracts you to this character and the music and everything? It's actually a challenge for me because, mm -hmm. as you said, I mean, I've been going from Baroque now into the dramatic repertoire. For me, it's very mm -hmm. curious and very interesting and very exciting to really see how the voice also develops. Mm -hmm. It's obviously a character, it's a story, um, it's a new, um, yeah, new personages, new type of women that I take onto it. Mm -hmm. And the music is just very, very beautiful. I mean, I was very surprised to see actually how lyrical and how romantic it can be, you know, how much you can color with the voice. And uh, it is a huge part and it's a very important part, but it's not the most difficult part that I've ever done in my life. <laughs> it's just different. It's just different. And yeah. I like different. You seem to uh, portray her perhaps a little differently than some other mezzos. Um... Yeah, you know what? Because first of all, I try to usually break out of the all possible cliches and yeah. to give a little a different touch to it and I believe and I try actually to give all my stage characters some humanity and I try to kind of get the parallel uh, of everyday's life and I do not believe that there is a person in the life who can do condemn somebody without any feelings of guilt at some point right otherwise and I, they'd be a sociopath well, exactly right? so. <laughs> so I don't think right. she's that no and I, I try to and because you know also because we know that the Sanson -Sans started actually to compose mm -hmm. the opera from the most famous art the love duet. I want to believe that that kind of is the guideline also a little bit of Delilah or Dalila. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> we can say her name however we choose. Roberto, Samson is one of the great tenor heroes in the repertoire. Could you tell us a little bit about your interpretation? I like the, the, the humanity, humanity of this character mm -hmm. because sure he has this, uh, this power from God he received from the, when he was born. But in the same time, it's very human. He's uh, attracted by beautiful girls. He has a lot of defects, <laughs> some qualities also. But, uh, <laughs> but he's a real Lots man. Of yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> a lot. A lot. <laughs> but uh, I, I love also the, the the fact that that he's in love till the end, mm. even if she's very rude with him. But he loves her very much until mm -hmm. the, the end. Well, and the dynamic between Samson and Dalila is both very, it's very physical and a, and a big mm. mental struggle. So how are their encounters for the two of you on stage? You must have a lot of chemistry with your partner. Otherwise well, and you two have work. the greatest chemistry, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> right? The audience knows you from <laughs> Carmen. And they've seen you in that HD. There have been hundreds of thousands of people <laughs> that have seen that HD. What, tell me a little bit more about your chemistry. <laughs> you must feel the same thing at the same moment. This uh -huh. is the chemistry. If you are in another mood, it doesn't work. Mm -hmm. And you don't need to speak about that. It's mm -hmm. something you have or you don't That's have. That's why we call it chemistry, yeah. I suppose. Yeah. Thank you so much for coming down Thank on your you. off day to speak to Thank me, you. you guys. Thank you very much. And nice. we really look forward to seeing Samson and Dalila on October And I would like 20th. also to have a, just a, a small uh, uh, think of uh, Montserrat Caballé because she passed away just, yes. just uh, yesterday. Yeah. We're all we thinking are, about yeah, her today yeah, as well. Yeah. So thank you, both Thank of you. you. Thank, Thank you. you.